What's up guys, my name is K9 and welcome back to the pack. Welcome back to another reaction and review video. Today we've got Crypt with Rapping From My Closet. Now Crypt is a dude that I've been following for quite a while now. I've been following a lot of his music. As I said as well with Nightmare with Chase. Now recently I've learned he did a diss on Tom McDonald. I'm not sure how long ago that was, but that has annoyed me a bit. However, I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt because I've been following him for a while and he is one of my favorite rappers out there at the moment. Now from what I gather, this is again, it says in the title, it's a one take video and I believe it's a freestyle rap as well. Again, don't quote me on it. I think that's what he said in one of his videos recently. Um, so I'm not gonna babble on. We're just gonna get straight in and see what we've got to offer for today so crypt let's go boom i just try to stick to myself yeah. there's too many snakes in the grass okay. too, many. too many fakes in the game many two-faced men with holes in my back my back i just want to write my rap okay. yeah. Now I've got to say already, this track sounds insane. I'm half expecting there to be a drop in a bit as well, but this is one thing that I do like about Crypt in the sense that sometimes even when he starts spitting it fast, it's difficult to understand a lot of the stuff he's saying. So in a lot of his raps as well, he does put these uh, almost subtitles in the video as well, which I do enjoy because then I can read what he's saying as well if I don't understand it. Um, so let's go back to the beginning again because this track is going to get insane. I can just tell already. I just try to stick to myself. Yeah. There's too many snakes in the grass. Too many, too many fakes in the game. Many two-faced men with holes in my back. My back. I just wanna write my raps. Yeah, I'm tired, my mom and my dad. my dad. So excuse me, please. Yeah. I'ma do me, and you can get the fuck off my back. Yeah. Oh, y'all yes. almost to a million and made it without spending a single cent on the paper click adsense. Other rappers wanna say they didn't pay for their promotion, but I got papers that say this shit's a fat fib. Ooh. Now I don't know if rappers diss me on the low, so they can brag to the friends that they diss me and I didn't even know. But you can tell by the tone that they know that they don't stand a chance if we go toe to toe. But I. Why stress this? Yeah. Lines don't concern yourself with sheep. White test script. Boy, I'm on fire like a tire in a wreck pit. Try and blow at my flame. Boy, that's a death wish. It's becoming common misconception when I rap it, rap it. People think of babbling about nothing. But I'm saying twice the stuff in half the time. You complain because you tried and it came out sucking. Uh, Fuck it. Ah, there we go. Okay. So it seems all of these YouTube rappers will be getting dissed from a lot of other people. So what Crip seems to be saying is there's a lot of fake people that we thought were obviously friends with and everything. And they've kind of turned around, stabbed him in the back. That's had a lot of the lyrics in the first half of this song so far. But it seems to me he's saying again that um, there's a lot of people similar to Tom McDonald in the sense that there's people that have dissed him that he doesn't even know about because maybe they're smaller channels or anything um, again he wants to say he wants to retire his mum and dad he wants to be able to keep rapping in order to make enough money to be able to do that um, cause he's very family orientated his crypt as well which I know about he's been double the words in half the time again cause he's a fast rapper a lot of the time he's saying a lot of people try and do it and fail doing it which I know I, I do because obviously I, I can't keep up with these words um, myself so let's, let's go back a bit and uh, carry on here but rapping people think of babbling about nothing but I'm saying twice the stuff in half the time you complain cause he tried and it came out sucking fuck every day back on the same topic when it's gonna stop all this dissing is nonsense I would rather work together than to bitch about it get up on the record with me spit it then we'll get it Yes, that's another thing as well. Uh, if one thing I do know about Crip from watching his videos for a while is the fact that he doesn't seem to like having any sort of beef with anyone unless it's well-deserved beef. Uh, like again, and many of you might know that he was on a track dissing KSI a while back and now he's on a song on the deluxe album with KSI and everything like that. So that beef's been squashed and he's not one of the people that seems to carry on these beefs as, as long as he can do. Um, he's one of those people that wants to squash it as soon as possible because he'd rather have friends and enemies uh, which is rare to find in a rapper as well, so I appreciate that. Let's just go back a bit here and carry on. I would rather work together than the bitch about to get up on the record with me spit it, then we'll get a crowd to sit around and listen to us spit and then we'll get a tally of the better sounding spitter. It's simple, it's kidding. Now go count it out. I guarantee that you will see that all your votes ain't even close to equaling half of the votes from me. What a scheme that was. All this shit is so fun. I just rap it because I'm happy. You just rapping because you lunch and I lease you up like I always do. Another fat joke, but it's oh so true and I can't help but do it. So go review it and focus only on that and not the soulful music. Upload your stupid little hope. Review, bitch, and hope it grows to get vocals and views. It's Excuse me, my reviews are decent. Come on. You know, I get what he means. Again, like people normally use his name and titles to review and kind of slate his songs just in order to get views. Um, but again, I don't get a lot of views on my videos anyway, but that doesn't bother me as long as I'm giving my opinion towards it and everything. So we'll go back. I know that wasn't about me personally, because you, you, you won't have a clue who I am, but uh, let's but go. But it's oh so true, and I can't help but do it. So go review it and focus only on that and not the soulful music. Upload your stupid little hopeless review, bitch, and hope it grows to get vocals and views. It's sad that these people want to talk shit when they never met okay. Crip, because I would befriend them, but why do I expect nothing but Isn't respect it? from these specs of the rap game? they nothing but dust. You and I both know that I'm better than most, and your whole career is a bust. So give me my rose while I can't smell those, and I'll go ascend to the sun. This is the last time that I will address it all these negative comments you know i have an ill obsession suddenly when i rap about my depression i sound like an f and that's a definite way to discredit all my messages i'm sounding like me every time i'm on the beat stop comparing me to others Ooh. and then maybe you will see that's no yes. disrespect to nate he's one of the greatest in the game but the second you take away then i'm rapping about my pain i'm gonna stab and go insane because i dealt with it all 
on the daily, maybe think before you say this shit'll begin to speak my way. Hey, album reviews just came in. Tales from the crypt got a three out of ten. No the guy told me that I way. How did that album get a three out of ten? There's no way that's true. Come on. I thought his album was insane, but apparently I'm one of the minority. That's really strange. I thought it was a decent album, but let, let's carry on again. Go back. Album reviews just came in. Tales from the crypt got a three out of ten. A guy told me that I rap too much about my dead grandma and that I sound like a bitch. Wow, some of y'all have no soul. She was my best friend, but she didn't even know that I made a lot of dough from spitting infinite flows. Even though some of y'all say I stole a bunch of those, but when I ask what I stole, y'all don't even know. Cause I never stole shit but the art from your home and y'all lost it. This is nonsense. I'm on the way to blow up. Y'all watch this. I just turned down a six figure deal. Fuck trying to hey. appeal. I'll keep rapping from a closet. Oh, that was good. That was good. So he turned down a six-figure deal. Now, again, I hear all these rappers saying about them turning down massive deals. A lot of the time, it's not true. However, with Crypt, it does sound like it could possibly be true. So he said, instead of being part of a label where he gets paid lots of money to rap and everything, he'd rather keep rapping from his closet, which is what the title of the song is, uh, because that's that's how he always talks about in his videos, about his recording studios, literally just his closet. That's literally where he records his songs. And so he'd say, I'd rather be doing that than go into a massive studio with a big company. Like with Crypt and a lot of these other rappers that I do listen to, they kind of have built themselves up from the ground without any promotion, without any like throwing money at everything they can. Um, they're not relying on other people, they're kind of doing it all themselves. And that's something that I really, really like. But yeah, this song was good. That track was nice as well. And as he said, it's a common misconception that he always raps fast and he raps about nothing. Uh, because again it is, I, like, I know him as a fast rapper because a lot of his songs he does do a fast rap in uh, but with this song as an example I think he was basically saying that obviously he doesn't always want to rap fast but when, even when he does rap fast it's always about something, it's not just random words joined together like a lot of rappers that I listen to do do and it's really annoying um, so I'm glad he's kind of taking it down and got a bit of a slower more meaningful rap to this one as well again I'm well surprised that Tales from the Crib got a 3 out of 10 that's something that's massively surprising to me. As for this song, I'm not sure if he does one take freestyle videos a lot. Uh, There's not a lot that I've seen of him doing this as well. So this was something that was nice to look at. It's completely different to what I'm normally used to with Crip. Uh, as for a rate or a hate, I've got to rate this video. This video is brilliant because there is one take. The colouring in this as well. Like, I like looking at all the edits and everything of this sort of thing. Obviously there wasn't any edits as in cuts and paste and everything in this video. Editing wise as in like the colouring and everything like that was really really nice to look at. It made it very viewable. But yeah, this song would definitely go on my playlist. Even though it's a song with a chorus that I'm not a massive fan of as I keep saying before um, I appreciate that and I'm glad he's back making music because his album I think was actually a month or two ago I'm not sure exactly how far away it was but I'm glad he's kind of back uploading music and everything obviously he does his own reviews as well uh, but if you did like this as well be sure to go and check out his channel be sure to check out that video give it a view give him a subscribe if you enjoy his content as for me if you want to see more like this and get notified when a new video goes up be sure to click that bell icon and if you did like this video be sure to leave a like if you want to see more like this then subscribe for now I shall see you later